One of the most hotly contested issues when it comes to offensive linemen is arm length. Both sides will go back and forth about its importance, but at the end of the day, if a lineman is good enough, the arm length doesn't matter. We've seen many players succeed at offensive tackle with shorter arms, but some teams won't even give those players a shot. Is Peter Skaronsky one of those players worth taking a shot on, or is he just another inevitable convert to guard? Find out in today's 2 Minute Drill. Let's address the elephant in the room. Skaronsky has less than ideal arm length, rumored to be around 32.5 inches long. To put that in perspective, since 2005, zero offensive tackles have been taken with sub-33 inch arms within the first 30 picks of the draft. The deck is already stacked against Skaronsky before you even see him play, and to become a legitimate first round prospect with short arms, you need to have amazing athleticism or tape. As expected, Skaronsky's arm length is a constant issue on tape. He fails to gain leverage in many situations, and frequently allows opposing players to get their hands on him first and drive him back. He has trouble with players beating him on the outside and using their speed to get to the QB. Skaronsky is not without his positives, he does have upside as a player. He uses good technique with his hands, and is able to land solid punches to slow down pass rushers. He possesses a solid anchor, and is able to lock down opponents that try to bull rush him. He is a decent mover in space, but this is really where his lack of explosive athleticism hurts him. He isn't always able to get to the second level as fast as he should, and it impacts some plays. However, he is an overall asset in the run game due to his natural power in his lower half. When Skaronsky does get his hands on the defender first, he is able to drive them back and create holes in the run game. His size does cap his upside in this area, and he does have his moments of losing his anchor against stronger players. For a player comp, Skaronsky reminds me of Elijah Vera Tucker. Vera Tucker was another college tackle with sub-33 inch arms, who people thought would be able to make the transition to tackle. However, Vera Tucker started out as a guard first, and I see a similar path happening for Skaronsky. I think the NFL is desperate enough to give him a shot at tackle, but he will need some time at guard first to smooth out his technique before he is able to make the switch. For draft range, it all comes down to the measurements and testing for Skaronsky. Good measurements with a closer to 33 inch arms and a decent height weight combo could land him within the first 15 picks. However, a disappointing combine and a closer to 32 inch arm length could cause him to slide to the end or even out of the first round. And that's the 2 minute drill.